Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel Texture1504 and today I'll be starting this very small yet very useful series in which I'll be telling you guys something that you need to know in order to install Windows 10 or any other version of Windows in your PC or laptop. Now my main purpose of creating this series is to make people capable enough to install an operating system in their devices because I've seen a lot of people and even students from technical background spending good amount of money to other people in internet cafes and other such places just to do simple tasks like formatting their PCs or installing a new operating system. And to be honest, it's just waste of money as the process of installation is very simple and can be easily done by any person. So in this first video, I'll be telling you on how you can officially download the setup of the latest version of Windows on your system for free. And in my next videos, I'll be telling you on how to install it. Now to those of you who don't know me, my name is Utsav and I create tech related videos that can be used by any common person to help himself out in their day to day life. So please consider subscribing to my channel and also hit the notification bell for a lot more useful videos like this. Now without wasting any further time, let's start this video. So the first thing you're gonna need to install Windows is the Windows setup file. Now you can either buy a hard copy of it or you can download the ISO file for free from Microsoft's official website which later on you can use to manually install Windows in any system. So in order to download the file just visit this website. The link by the way is in the description box below. So once you're in this website click the download tool now button. The file is just around 18 megabyte in size. So once it's downloaded, head to the folder where it's located. I've got it here in my desktop. So now just open it up like any normal application. But make sure that you are connected to the internet as we'll be downloading the setup file. Now wait for a couple of seconds till it gets the things ready. So now once it's done, click accept. Once you do that, you'll see this page which asks what do you want. The first option over here says upgrade this PC now. But we'll not select that because you might want to install Windows on a different system. So we'll select the second option, create installation medium. And then select next. Now here, you can either go for the recommended settings or manually change it to what you'd like such as change the setup language, Windows 10 edition or architecture. I'll recommend you to leave it as it is, but there's no harm in tweaking the options as long as you know what you're doing. So once we click next, it provides us with two options. Using the first one, we can directly create a bootable pen drive using which we can install Windows on any device. But there's a problem. If you select this option, your pen drive will convert into a bootable pen drive. So if you will format it later to use it as a normal pen drive, all the data inside it will be gone and the next time you'd want to install Windows, you'll have to download the whole file again which is approximately 5GB in size. So we'll select the second option which is gonna download the ISO file which we can later use to create a bootable pen drive whenever we'd want. So once we choose the ISO file option, we'll click on next. Now it'll ask you for the location where you'd want to save the ISO file. So select the location and then click on save. That's it. Now it'll download the ISO file which we'll use to create a bootable pen drive and then we can use that pen drive to install Windows on any system we want. And don't worry as I'll be telling you on how to do all of that in my next videos. So this was it for today guys, I really hope that this video was helpful to you and if it was then make sure to leave the like button turned on, share it with your friends and subscribe to my channel as I try to create very simple videos on topics that can help you out in your daily life. And yes, do not forget to hit the notification bell so that you get notified whenever I upload a new video. So I'll see you guys in my next video, till then, goodbye.